Hey guys, Connor here. Um, I just shot a video uh, and I realized that maybe it's a better idea to do two videos instead. Um, one for everyone who's dealing with the uh, like mental health issues and, and disability things. So you can watch that and then keep up to date with me on that. And then also uh, check out, there'll be another video it's talking about my stream, talking about what I do for a living as well. So um, I just recently, it's been a month since I had my pacemaker put in um, it's healing up well uh, I've had to go back to the ER a couple times pacemaker clinic a couple times which is funny because when I go to the pacemaker clinic it's inside the hospital and I've asked I've been asked if I've had been close to anyone with COVID or any all the protocols like 55 times in the last month it's like to the point where the reception's like oh yeah just go in and I don't know if that's a good thing or not because I don't really want to be a, a known person at the hospital um, but it is what it is. Uh, pacemaker seems to be working fine. Um, there's a couple minor problems, but they're getting sorted out. The medication has made me very dizzy, very sleepy. Um, I've had this weird thing where I've thrown up four meals in the last two weeks. Not immediately, but like an hour later, I just like feel really sick and I just like had to vomit. So that, that really is weird because I haven't thrown up for years it feels like before that but anyways um i just want to also mention um for people dealing with like muscular dystrophy or other physical disabilities um you know i'm here to talk to you i'll always say that you can always message me i've uh, talked to the muscular dystrophy uh, association I've talked to muscular dystrophy canada i've talked to a couple of gaming uh like sponsors that deal with uh, gamers with disabilities um, some responded some didn't some were really nice um, and yeah so I'm trying to work on that to maybe partner up and and get more uh, coverage talk about it which would be great um, also recently from my YouTube video or from watching my stream m lots of people have messaged me uh, talk to me in real life even like and just you know hey when you talk about your uh, me like mental illness or mental disability I get or not disability mental health issues on stream or on YouTube it, it creates like a, a safe space for people to come in and like they said you know now I feel like I can talk to you about it or I feel like I can talk to my parents about it my significant other about it like so that's like really the goal for me is to have the ability to talk about my issues openly because I realize that people aren't as open as I am about their uh, mental health issues or physical disability issues and I am so I'm an open book you can always ask me I'll always respond um, whether it's <clears throat> on any social media DM or in game when I'm playing video games or if you're watching this in real life and you're a real life friend of mine or you're not a real life friend of mine but you still watch this and we know each other i'll always talk to anyone about it man like your problems my problems you want to ask me questions i'm all about it so that's just for anyone um going forward we're gonna be trying to partner up with more uh like organizations try to get some more awareness more coverage it's hard it's hard being such a small youtuber such a small streamer um it's not that they don't give me the light of day it's just like you know is it worth their time to put to invest in me so um overall i'm really like i'm feeling really positive about the stream going forward my job going forward um i'm positive about my health jackson's birthday is thursday coming up uh december 3rd he's turning two i'm beyond excited with the covid uh restrictions where i live uh no one can come over he's gonna get dropped off at 7 a.m from his mother um we're gonna hang out all day and then he's gonna go home or go back to his mom's house uh later that night and unfortunately you know we're not gonna be able to have my parents her her jackson's mom over we're not gonna be able to have extended family or friends or anything like that uh like a normal birthday party but you know, at least we get to hang out. We're gonna have a cake. We've given him gifts already. I'm so excited. Uh, he's just a crazy 
cute little man and uh, he's really been my driving like motivation to get feeling better and and just overall just like motivation to succeed in life has been having him so if you're watching this in 10 years Jackson I love you um, yeah it's tough it's tough to talk about because there's a time where I didn't think I was gonna make it um, and now I feel like I'm in a, a lot better place. I don't know what the future holds. I don't want to Google anything about pacemakers. I feel like I'm a, a one of one case. So I'm just taking it day by day, trying to heal um, and just letting everyone know I'm out there for you. If you uh, want to stop in the stream, all the links will be in the bottom. You can come message or come chat with us. There's lots of people that are super nice. Uh, if you want to just watch and do your thing that's totally fair to you um but i hope everyone had a good american thanksgiving and i hope everyone's safe and healthy and if i don't make another video which i plan on doing it before christmas merry christmas everyone yeah so anyways have a good one